People have been doing stupid things since forever. Now, don't think that back in the day, young people never made bad decisions. Of course they did. But you do have to wonder if society is on a downward spiral, almost circling the drain. There's real concern today about the behavior of tourists, not just people on passenger planes who are acting badly more often than ever, but tourists like the British man who carved his and his girlfriend's initials into the Colosseum. A few months later, a girl from Switzerland did the same thing. A Canadian tourist carved his name into a pillar in a 1,200-year-old Japanese temple. An Irish tourist climbed a statue in Brussels and caused $19,000 in damage. Amsterdam has an advertising campaign aimed at young British men called Stay Away. Some of the silly stuff is done for social media, internet idiocy at its best. But there's a lack of common sense, responsibility, and maturity that's breathtaking. Paul wrote to Timothy, a young church leader, and said in 1 Timothy 4.12, Let no one despise your youth. But be an example to the believers in word, in conduct, in love, in spirit, in faith, in purity. Be an example. And of course, this goes way beyond youth. While you wouldn't think a 75-year-old would carve their initials into a World Heritage Site, that person might be grumpy. That's bad behavior, not an example to the believers. The 40-year-old fooling around on their spouse? Bad behavior. A poor example reflects on society or on the church, and it reflects on yourself. A generation ago, you showed off to your friends. Now people can show off to the world. Better to show Jesus off and let people see how good He is rather than how smart you are. I'm John Bradshaw for It Is Written.